This has been a long and challenging week, battling the fires that raged throughout Israel. It was an extremely complex operation. There were more than 1,700 individual fires. More than 70,000 people were forced to evacuate their homes, and 1,895 homes were damaged. We had to fight together, both firefighters on the ground and pilots from the air, against 39 large fires that threatened many, many parts of Israel. And you succeeded. But the most important number, dear friends, is zero. Zero is the number of people who lost their lives. Jewish tradition teaches that he who saves even one life, it's as if he saved an entire world. You helped save many lives and many words. So first of all, in the name of the government, the firefighters, the police, and the people of Israel, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Yeah, yeah, you deserve it. Let me be absolutely clear. We will show zero tolerance for these kinds of attacks. I have instructed the Israeli police to spare no effort in order to identify these terrorists and bring them to justice. We will find and reach anyone, anyone who tries to harm the safety and security of Israel's citizens. Friends, as soon as we understood the seriousness of the situation, we turned to your countries and government for assistance. You quickly responded and showed that you and your countries are true friends of Israel.